Armenian Relief Society is an international relief organization founded in New York City. As the number of chapters and members increase on the West Coast, the ARS Western USA region became a separate administrative entity in 1984. Currently, there are 26 chapters in the states of California, Arizona, Nevada, and Texas. The challenges began right before we became a regional. You had to prepare the membership that this region was going to become an entity of its own. We did not have an office. We did not have a building. We started developing the idea that we need a place of our own. And as a result of one of our articles in Aspares, that ARS needs a home, Bunlebet Kuchununi, a very dedicated Armenian mother, uh, Nazikyan, Armenian Nazikyan, gave us $50,000. At that time, 30 years ago, $50,000 was a great deal of money for us. In 1988, the Nazikyan home at 517 West Glen Oaks Boulevard in Glendale was acquired. A two-story structure was built at the original location and placed into service in July 1999. The Nazigam home was very small. The uh, social services was growing. Uh, so were, uh, our chapters were growing. So we did not have a place to come together uh, to have meetings or uh, the social services did not have enough room to add more employees. So we tear down the building and we built this beautiful two-story building. During the earthquake and the nagorno karabakh war, this center served as a, a focal point of people walking in, even non-Armenians, and making donations to either for uh, the Garapag war or for the uh, earthquake relief. The most important programs of the region were the ARS One Day Schools, which became the basis for establishment of day schools from the 1960s to the 1980s. Along with the Armenian language, the Saturday or One Day Schools teach Armenian history, music, and arts. To further develop awareness and comprehension of the Armenian culture, inter-school performances and competitions are organized. We encourage the chapters to start projects of their own. And that was when we started uh, asking the chapters to give scholarships to deserving students in the public school. Scholarships are provided on the local and regional levels. Each year, needy students attending Armenian schools are provided with tuition grants. Other scholarships are provided to college students based on different requirements of specific funds. Each June, chapters provide merit-based awards to public high school graduates. Award ceremonies are being held at the ARS Regional Headquarters in order to provide the students an opportunity to learn about the ARS. I am delighted to be here at the Armenian uh, Relief Society and I am even more delighted to be here because of Haik and Harut and they are always the su success of our students is the payoff for the counselors. During the early years the ARS provided social services with volunteer efforts through local chapters. In order to make services more effective and to meet the needs of new immigrants in February 1979, the ARS Social Services offices were established. Armenia Relief Society has helped a lot of people and has opened many doors, and one of them is mine. The ARS Child, Youth, and Family Guidance Center was established in the year 2000 to provide free counseling services to needy families and particularly to the youth. The center is funded by ARS chapters and public and private sponsors. The ARS has continued to provide assistance 
to victims of natural disasters, such as those of the hurricanes in the States and Haiti, the famine victims in Africa, and the earthquake and tsunami in northeastern Japan. In 1975, following the civil war in Lebanon, the ARS led the community to raise funds for the Armenians in Lebanon. During the decades that followed the two wars in Iraq, the ARS assisted the Armenians in Iraq through the ARS Iraqi Fund Committee. Following the earthquake in Spidak, Armenia in 1988, the ARS conducted a worldwide campaign to help the survivors and assist in rebuilding the region. The role of the Western USA region was establishing mental health clinics and optic centers and providing portable clinics, ophthalmological and dentistry equipment, including prosthesis center equipment for manufacture of artificial arms and limbs. In 1991, the Sponsor a Child program was started to assist the children orphaned due to the earthquake or the liberation struggle in Nagorno-Karabakh, also known as Artsakh. In 2005, the Orphans Education Program was initiated to provide sponsorship for those former sponsor child enrollees who were continuing their education by attending universities. The region renovated and continues to provide operational expenses for two ARS Sosa kindergartens in the villages of Ashan and Aganapertz in Artsakh. Այս շրջանը հովանավորում է երկու մանկապարտեզները աշանի եւ ականաբերտինը որնորեն հովանավորում է մեր բարերարների մեր հովանավորների կողմից մանավանդ ովքեր որ միշտ այցելում են իրենք գնում են տեսնում են աշխատանքը հոմի քաջալերված նորեն մյուս տարի իրենց հովանավորությունը պահելու է մանկապարտեզների համար սատարեն կանգնում շրջանի ականաբերտը այս տեսակետից որ սահմանամարտ հին շաոմյանի արտեն շրջանում է գտնվում եւ շատ զարմանալի է որ ականաբերտի շրջանը Lor în tanic nere bazma zavaken. Vor de amen în tanic meci ca iot, ut, in, ierecha. Iar că haju că să stau nu vor amen în camet mes, iar des mes esenț merha jogort și a tanum. In addition to operational funding, each year the ARS sends a large quantity of supplies, including uniforms, not just for the students at the two kindergartens that the region sponsors, but all the kindergartens in Artsakh. The ARS is honored to host official guests from Armenia and Artsakh who are appreciative of the ARS contributions to the homeland. Javakh is a historically Armenian region located north of Armenia in Georgia. In 2001, the ARS Javakh Fund was established in order to lighten the burden of Armenians living in the economically and culturally suppressed region. The ARS Javakh Fund provided funding to establish clinics, training for nurses, electricity infrastructure, and most importantly, youth centers in Akhalkalak and Akhaltsha. The region continued to pay for operational expenses of these centers. The students attending Armenian schools on the West Coast do their share by raising funds through the Piggy Bank project. As the Armenians in Syria started to experience civil war, the ARS mobilized to fund the schools and provide assistance. Due to the ongoing nutritional needs of the people in the war-ravaged country, the ARS in Syria re-initiated a program to provide hot foods to the needy and the elderly. Hayok Lucian Miyuchuna, Lalov Parekor Zagan Gazmager Buchun, Yergo Hazar Dasnamek Tavaganen, Arachin Gazmager Buchun Neren Yerav, Vor Sadar Hanti Satsav, Yevasav Meng Aistereng, Ojan Tagelu Mer Hairinagit Serun, Yev Arten, Himnatram Ner Sterzavazen, Yev Mer Shurchana, Aremadian Amerigai Shurchana, Hedevetsav Getrangan Barchutian Gochin, Եվ մենք մեր փարոյական եւ նյութական օժանդակությունը հասցուցինք, 
Polor ayn himnatram nerun vor besi mer hayrena gitsnere suryo mech sharunagen irens gensagam betkera. Surya hay mer hayrena gitsnere ojantagutyan khntira hamaskayin bardavoruchun e yev askayin arachnahertuchun aysorerun. In order to coordinate efforts with the rest of the community, the ARs became a part of a community-wide organization, the Syrian Armenian Relief Fund, SARF. Եվ մենք որբես գազմագերվություն, եւ մենք որբես հայ ասկ բադրաստ ենք օժանդակելու մեր Սուրիահայ, մեր Քեսաբի հայության։ Եվ ամեն ցևով պիտի օժանդակենք իրենց քոյության իմաստին, իրենց ֆիզիկական քոյության մինչև հասնին եւ վերադառնան իրենց տունը։ The ARS strives to keep the Armenian culture alive with a festival as a means to preserve and share the Armenian culture. Since 2012, the Winter Festival was started to bring snow and snow slides, amusement rides, live entertainment, and games to children. The ARS has been participating in the LA Marathon and 5K walk runs for over a decade and has raised awareness against domestic violence. Our strength is in our membership. And the stronger the chapter is, the more involved the chapter is with its community, the stronger our organization is. Arayt goç guğeng, polor mer hayrına gitsnerun, yevan tamnerun, sadar hanti sanal, hedevil, hayok nutyan miyutyan goçerun, yev nişt badrast allal ojantagelu, yev zalayelu, mer hayrına gitsnerun, ur voral allan amun. All local and international ARS programs and disaster relief efforts continue with small and large contributions by many supporters and volunteers who understand that the ARS will lend a hand wherever it's needed. Thank you for your support.